Hey guys, Windows 8 Team Hacks here, and um, I'm going to be showing you how to create a Windows 8.1 Pro with Media Center ISO image. Now, um, what you're going to want to do is um, go to the link in the description and download the um, Windows Assessment and Development Kit. And then uh, click on download, save or run it. I have already installed it. So it's going to ask me to change. And what you're going to want to do is only have development tools checked and uncheck anything else that has been checked. And then continue with the, with the installation as you would originally. And um, now what you're going to want to do is go ahead and um, create a folder in your C drive and name it Win81 and then create three subfolders ISO, Mount and WIM and then um, you're going to want to extract your Windows 8.1 ISO image to the um, folder ISO and um, I'm going to select the ISO image of um, the 64-bit one and what you're gonna want to do is copy it all over to that folder Gonna copy it all over to the ISO. Another thing you're gonna need to note is that you are required to have about 10 to 20 gigabytes free of your hard drive on solid state and um, yeah once it has finished copying go to the ISO folder go to sources and then um, move the largest file which is um, install WIM to the um, WIM folder And once you have done that, you um, go to the commands in the description and open up your um, open up the program development and imaging tools. Run as administrator, and then um, copy and paste the commands one by one. Now that that is done, you can just exit and then go ahead and start making the IE config file. Which I have already made, but you just go ahead and uh, copy the IE config settings in the um, description to make it so then you don't have to create a um, 
you don't have to enter in the installation key. Just open up Notepad, paste it, save it, change the text documents to all files, and then just enter in ie.cfg and then save it and then you move it over to the into the sources folder which would be in um, ISO and sources and then to create the ISO image just copy the command from the description and reopen the um, development uh, tools run as admin And that is it. The ISO image should be approximately about 4 gigabytes. This has been brought to you by Windows 8 PMX. Like, comment, subscribe.